three properties around Omaha are up for demolition. City Council members will vote to bring down the dilapidated homes in the north and west parts of the city. KETV Newswatch 7's Alex McLoon is live with the cost of doing the work. Demolishing all three homes cost $76,000. It was up for public hearing at City Council today because that's a lot of money. But each property owner is on the hook, according to a city official, and you can play a part by keeping an eye out in your neighborhood. We've received complaints on all three separately. So. City Planning Director Process. Dave Fanslaw says those complaints came from neighboring homeowners of these properties over the past year. This vacant North Omaha home connected to a daycare, which burned in a fire last year and hurt a firefighter. An overgrown property with a pool and tennis court near Westside High School in this house with a barn in Northwest Omaha. Property owners couldn't be reached for comment, but they're now part of a demo package. The city says their owners are on the hook. We have a budget for demo, uh, and then there's a lien put on the property. So once that lien is paid by either the, the current property owner or somebody new, we get that money back, it goes back into our budget. The city says the $76,000 price tag is costlier than normal demolitions because of the property's empty structures and tree removal. Those are signs you can keep an eye on and alert the city about. Officials will reach out to owners in order to restore properties. But at some point um, when we've extinguished all of our processes, we issue the, the, the demo order and those three are was part of a demo package that went out. That city official says Omaha is building a list of other properties that are receiving complaints. They'll work through that list, then post bids for demolition. As for the three homes we talked about here today, nobody opposed demolishing them, so this now heads to council members for a vote. Live at City Hall, Alex McClune, KETV Newswatch 7.